It's the last day for Joe out here out west this year. This is his last morning. This is it, boy. We ended up not putting up turkeys last night because of the rain. But I got a hankering where I know a few are. But it's full moon and their tendency to roost in cottonwood trees. I think I know we can go find a couple. So that's what we're going to go do. to the crest of this ridge right straight to the right of it. 60. Dang it.
Walking on. Yeah, and I looked at two gobblers, two binoculars, and I yelled, they didn't, they didn't think about shit, they didn't gobble, nothing. You know? Yeah. What the deal is? I don't know. I said we just back up and go try to find that one down the creek. I think he gobbled again a while ago. I was only when I got up, but they walked across in front of me right there. Yeah. I don't know how far it is. I wouldn't have shot until I ranged it, but... Yeah, it looks right on the fringe, don't it? The problem is, is when the sun's hitting their heads real hard like that, it's hard to tell if they're gray or red yeah. or what. I mean, it looks like just blowed out, you know? Yeah. Hell, I probably wouldn't have shot one of them anyway. It's just whacking all the stuff, you know? Yeah. I want to go back and hunt that goblin one down there. See, see if we can get him to gobble. Yep. I'll just crawl back out. Mm, yep, to these turkeys, they don't even. They ain't even doing nothing. They ain't doing nothing. We found the other group of turkeys we could hear in the distance this morning. But they've flown down and went to the high side as well, which is on private in this situation. And, uh,. We're just drifting over closer. I don't know if we can yep at one or what. What you thinking? Pretty steep yeah. bank, ain't it? Too tall, it's dry. Yeah. Hey, following this river, creek, little drain here until the falls are super tall on the side. The turkeys are over the top. Some of them are, property line runs up the top there. Some of them look right on the line, some of them across the line. They ended up being a flock with a handful of hens, two shredders, a handful of hens, one shredder, two long, big red-headed turkeys kind of mingling outside of both of them. I think that flock of turkeys, that single shredder should have been up in here still. I think the turkeys we have been hanging out for an hour or better. Some six hens over on that side. One hen came past us kind of close. But I think all the turkeys with the strutting turkeys is further over the line than we even thought. And it's all uphill through pasture, so it ain't like you 
I called on him. It sounded like it's carrying where it's a flip. So I'm going to walk right down here to this next little drain that funnels into the public. Send a call up it if we ain't done no good. Probably going to turn around. Probably it for Joe. Send him packing. Got to roll back toward the airport. Put him off on the jet plane in the morning. Roll out. There they go. Man, that was 15, 20 turkeys right there. Had to be. There's still turkeys running out of that thing. This is about to mess around and find out. <laughs> you ain't got your eyeballs on one? Yeah. Are you still being fluffy? Unfortunately, right now we're in a picnic area. <laughs> but it gives us a good vantage point. Just turn that camera around and show him to the people because he's standing right there. He's wanting, he's wanting you to video him. That's scary. You don't end up flushing him with that. You notice how hard he's looking over here, though? Mm hmm. He don't trust us, does he? No. All these people around here, and he's looking at us. <laughs> Getting your outfit on? Man. I'm trying to put your cherry on the top of this trip. It's been a good one. But we're down to the last hoorah. Day, whatever it is, is brought to you by White Gummy Bear Rain Total Body Fuel. Only way we can mess this up, I feel like, is if for some reason they've been coming over the top. I've been looking at the turkey over there yet. We're gonna drive we gonna drive with it. Yeah, on. I know. What is that? I was looking at that myself. Made a big loop. It ain't took it too long. What, 20 minutes, maybe 20? Uh, we'll have a little poke to get in there. I'm not even wearing my vest. There's so much crawling that goes on in this freaking country. I don't want nothing sticking up in the air. This is tactical insertion right here, buddy. At its finest. What is it? That's what it's going to have to be. I think it's a safer bet to stay on this lake down. I mean, this bank or get up in them cottonwoods. Probably six won't have none of the others. Your timing's gonna be a lot better here on this bank, but.
I mean, right when you think you got one figured out, he gives you the finger, I guess the feather. Man, we thought we had this one pinned. He was just loafing right here, heat of the day. These big pines and cedars. I mean, he was just loafing with a hen. I mean, we thought we had him nailed in a little nook where nobody else is looking. And yeah, we snuck in here like a couple of Seal Team Six, and we ain't heard hiding their hair that joker. He was gobbling at geese when we were across there looking. Right. He ain't here. Mm -mm. He's not in here. Nope. He wasn't here. He wasn't here. <laughs> he ain't in here no more. Nope. Listen, you wanna go around to over the top or you wanna go back around? Hey, we appreciate you guys joining us for this video. If you like this one, you'll probably like the next one. I'll leave it up here in the corner. Don't forget to subscribe and follow along with us. We'll leave our social media links down at the description below. That's also where you'll be able to find links on the turkey calls we use and the apparel we wear and that kind of stuff. So you can find that in that little drop-down description below. And uh, as always, we sure appreciate you guys following along.